Hi guys, in this tutorial, we will tell you, how to sync messages, between Slack and MS Teams, without any loop. Connect can get stuck in a loop, when they run, over and over again, from a single trigger event. Connect loops can occur, if you send messages, from Slack to MS Teams, and vice versa, as the action, is identical to the event it is triggered from. Thankfully, OpiPi Connect provides, a perfect solution for it. OpiPi Connect is a web-based integration platform, where you can integrate, any of your web applications, and automate the data, based on the events, you set up in the workflow. Let's see how it's done. First, click on the Connect Slack plus MS Teams. Here, you will see, OpiPi Connect has selected, Slack as your trigger app. Now, the system will show you, the available triggers, for Slack. Here, select new message posted to channel as your trigger event and click on continue. Then connect, to your, Slack account. We use bank level encryption, to keep your account information, safe and secure, we don't take chances, with your data. Once an account is added and tested, click on continue. Now, under the channel section, select the channel, OpiPi Connect needs to monitor. You have to, select an option, from the list menu. For example, video tutorial. Next, comes the tag section. Here add in default text with hashtag, example, hashtag slack. This helps in comprehending messages and avoid looping. Once done, select continue. Now, for the action app, search and select Microsoft Teams. Based on your selection, the system, will show you, the available actions, for Microsoft Teams. Select send channel messages as your action event, and click on continue. Then connect your Microsoft Teams account. This gives, OpiPi Connect, permission to send messages to channels in MS Teams. Once, an account, is added and tested, click on Continue. Now, under the Microsoft Teams section, select the desired team, to which, OpiPi Connect, needs to send the message, let's select, Video Tutorial. Then, under the Channel section, choose the channel, in which you want, OpiPi Connect, to send the message, we'll choose, Connect. Now. In the message section, you can choose, your Slack messages as your Teams message, and OpiPi Connect, will send this, to Teams channel, whenever, Slack receives a new message. Next, comes the tag section. Here, you can add, a default text with, hashtag example, hashtag mass team, to comprehend messages, as above. Once done, select continue. Now, when you click on run a test, OpiPi Connect checks whether your automation is working according to your demand or not. Then you'll see OpiPi Connect run a test for you. Once the test is successful and enabled, you have a Connect created from Slack to MS Teams. Now, let's try, to create, another Connect, from MS Teams to Slack. In this case, we will choose, MS Teams, as the trigger app, and, new message posted to channel, as the trigger event. Make sure, to connect, to the same. MS Teams account, which you, authorized, for the above connect. In the edit section, let's choose, video tutorial, and, connect, as the team and, channel name. Note, the team, and channel, should be the same, as the above connect. Next, in the tag section, add, hashtag MS Team, as tag message. When, all is done, select continue. For action, we will choose, Slack as the action app, and, send channel message, as the action event. Make sure, to connect, to the same Slack account which you authorized for the above connect. In the edit section, let's choose, video tutorial, as the channel name. Note, the team, and, channel, should be the same, as the above connect. Now, in the message section, you can choose, your team's messages, as your Slack message, and, OpiPi Connect, will send this to, Slack channel, whenever. Teams receives a new message. Next, in the tag section, add, hashtag slack, as tag message. When all is done, select continue. Now, when you click, on, run test, OpiPi Connect, checks whether, your automation is working, according to your demand, or not. Then, you will see, OpiPi Connect, run a test for you. Once, the test, is successful, and enabled, let's check out, how it works. Let us send, two messages, from Slack, test, and testing hashtag Slack. And, check out, MS Teams. We see, the message, 
without tag is shown, that is test hashtag ms team. Now, let's check the opposite. Try sending, two messages, from ms teams, India, and India USA hashtag ms team. Let's, check out, Slack. Again, we see, the message without tag is shown, that is, India hash Slack. So, we created, bidirectional messaging, without looping. That's all from today's session, thank you for watching.